when a tool is so good, I feel like it's my responsibility to share it with you guys. It's been a few months now that I'm using Cargo Pro and I'm shocked how good it is. And just to be clear, I do have an affiliate link if you want to support my channel, but I'm not paid by this team, it's my honest opinion. If you don't know Cargo, it's a tool that lets you import assets in your scene and we're talking about 10,000 models and materials. And not any random models, those are professional assets used in TV shows and movies like Doctor Strange, Last of Us, Star Trek, just to name a few. And before I tell you and show you how good it is and how I use it in my workflow. I wanted to make this video now because the Cargo Pro subscription is actually 50% off. It means that if you subscribe now, you will keep this price during all your subscription period. And this is why I truly think it's a fantastic opportunity. And on top of that, they just added a vehicle part. So now you also have vehicles in cargo and more and more will be added. So if you want to check Cargo Pro, the link will be in the description. And now let me show you how it works and what are the assets we get. Okay, so I'm in cargo and because I have a pro subscription, I can access all the assets of the entire library and those assets are grouped by kits. And you have all types of environment that you need for your projects. For example, if you want a Game of Thrones like mood, you can use Iron Force. Here are all the assets of the kit and let me give you a better view of some of those buildings. Or if you prefer a cyberpunk atmosphere, you also have all the choice you need. You have Cyber District, Neo San Francisco or cyberpunk, just to name a few. And what I love as well is not only you get all the buildings around the team you have selected, but you also get high quality props like this or the boots or the door or the signs, the windows, etc. You really have all you need to create your own world. And concerning the updates, we will have one new world kit per month, that's huge, and also exclusive kits for Cargo Pro users. And just to test the assets, I did a quick animation with it. It took me like five minutes to set up, and here is the result. Now let me show you how I use it in my workflow. So I'm working actually on my new car animation and you will see the result in the next video. And I wanted to build a city. So I have selected three kits, Brooklyn for the buildings, storefronts for the shops, and some assets from city streets for the city props. In Cargo, you can either select the kit on this page and choose the assets you need in it, or you can go into models and select the kit from this dropdown. And this is how I prefer to work. I find it faster for my workflow because you can easily switch between kits without changing the page or simply select several kits at once. And sometimes when I'm not sure what kit to use, I simply type what I need. For example, neon sign. And here are the neon signs I could use in my projects. When I find the building or the prop I want to use for my scene, here is what I do. You select the asset. You can have a better view by clicking on this icon. You will find different photos of the asset in different angles. For the target software, here you can have the choice between all the major 3D programs on the market, Unreal, Houdini, Maya, and of course, Blender 4. And for the texture size, I have this simple rule. For the buildings, I always choose 2K or 1K if it's in the background. I feel that you don't really need more for an animation. And for the props, 1K is enough. If you're planning to do a close-up on a building or a prop, you can select 4K, it's up to you. Then you click download and you will have this little arrow icon when your asset is downloaded and ready to be imported. And the final step, you click import and you will have the asset in Blender. And let me show you another example with this one. So you click import. From there, you just have to set up your camera and some lights and boom, you have a beautiful animation just like that. And now you understand why I love cargo so much and why those are my go-to assets for all my projects. And once again, because there is a 50% sale, I really wanted to share this with you guys. Okay, that's it for today. As usual, all the links will be in the description. Don't hesitate if you have questions. I'll talk to you soon. Bye-bye.